Good afternoon, everyone. It's Christine Dreen here talking to you from New Westminster, British Columbia, Canada. It is November the 11th, day 329 of my everyday journey. I actually remembered it. <laughs> Wait, before I do the welcome, let's make sure that I'm correct. Make sure, guys, I'm correct. Yes, today is day 329 of my everyday journey. So welcome, everyone. <laughs> so I hope you guys are having a lovely day. And as I was checking out my... Eh, it's been a couple days since people have been checking out my everyday journeys on my YouTube. But that's okay. It seems to be more than just two or three people at a time, which is good. But it'll, people will catch up. That's good. I'm getting better. I think when I get more active and I get these on to YouTube, that's cool. I'm just having issues. I can't do a live now, so I have to upload these. Eventually, I'll figure out how to do a live more often. But I, I need to get a better um, webcam. I want to get a better webcam. Look out. I'm going to have more lives done. But you know what? We have to do with what we have and not complain. But today is a special day. Why am I today's a special day? Because it's... Remember to stay here up in Canada, and it's Veterans Day down south. So it's a special day of remembering all those beautiful people who served for our countries long ago, the variety of wars, as well as now. And they help us keep our land safe as much as we can. They can, and I think that's beautiful. What can we take from this today? We can take the fact that so many people our first responders, our police, our armed forces, our armies, they're all there to help keep us safe. And quite often it can be a trial and error, right? And it can be the hardest things. And quite often our wonderful first responders or policemen, they get killed in the, in the battlefield, so to speak, within the cities or wherever they are, helping serve us. And this is the beauty about this beautiful part of this day. I think we should celebrate them every single day. I think since today is Monday, it's also a motivational Monday to give thanks and love to those around us who help us when we are in need. It's a truly wonderful thing to do. Be thankful. That's why I do gratitude every day. That's why I do positive affirmations to stay strong. And that's why I'm always giving to selflessly to everyone around me as well. To share my thoughts, my ideas, and things I've known throughout these years, as well as this past 14 months, 15 months, on my ever never-ending journey of social media marketing as well and offline I'm trying to get back to that as well but I wanted to talk about this today because my true beautiful company cooler brands has a lot to do with that we are expanding with a beautiful fun duel which is helping veterans right now get back to start their life even further with wonderful memberships and cooler brands. Awesome, right? And they're doing a fun duel for the veterans and the first responders too. And I think that's beautiful, guys. Giving back as much as you can to those who've helped you too is a good part of staying positive and strong each day. And I wanted to really talk about that today because I don't really I don't really have a, a quote. I have a Remembrance Day quote because today is Remembrance Day and I'll like to relay that to you today as I do my best to get this together and share it. Uh, my quote is this, because I have about two quotes. I did two posts for Remembrance Day, because to me, because my father was a veteran. I mean, he didn't, he traveled quite a bit when I was young and he was always on overseas when I was a kid. So I didn't see him as often as I can when I was a child for a few, for a few years because he was part of the armed forces here in Canada. So he was traveling, he was going to Europe, he was doing a lot of stuff. And then he would see us from time to time. And then finally he retired because he wanted to get out of the armed forces and do other things in his life, you know. But I remember well, and I remember he served his his country well what he did and my dad's now a veteran he's over 80 he's 86 now and he's living a wonderful life um with his sweetie he has with living east of me absolutely a beautiful home and doing what he wants to do and i give thanks to my dad who helped keep fires burning really well here in canada and around the world we're serving everybody do right as well as i have an uncle who's long gone passed away i think he's been gone for 12 years now and his name is Victor Victor Bennett and he was a veteran he was actually in the World War II and I have a wonderful cousin who talks about his dad and the stuff he did and how he served our country too so this is wonderful things that I know a little bit about 
actually learning about it through my family, which is kind of cool. And so I celebrate this day of those who have passed, who served our country well, as well as all the countries around the world today, as well as the veterans down south, our first responders, our policemen, everyone who's helped serve in their community in a really impactful way. I wanted to talk about that today because that to me is important because that's also, like I said, this is also Motivational Monday, sharing you, giving you my thoughts to stay strong and happy and give of yourself of your time and energy to those around you as well. That can be part of how you can give back to giving up yourself, your time, your energy, your knowledge of how you can help others around you too. It's a truly wonderful part of being a giver too. That's what our first responders, those who've served our country well in past and now, they give up themselves and they help our country. And we can do the same thing within our communities too. So that's my quick little blip today on Remembrance Day as well as Veterans Day down the down, down south. And I wanted to really relay this message and share it and put it on YouTube and see what happens, guys. Because this is an important part of my life because my dad was a veteran and my uncle Vic was a veteran in his days because he was part of World War II. So I have a little bit of family history of being in the armed forces as well. It's kind of cool. So I wish you all a beautiful day. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this. Make today a great day in your everyday journey because only you can make it a great day. Give back. Give somebody some help within your community. Give of yourself and your time and your energy to help one another. This is the best part of life too. Okay, my love to y'all. I'll see you tomorrow on day 330 of my everyday journey. Bye.